Hello, hello, and happy Creative Card Challenge Wednesday, everyone. I am back. <laughs> oh, wow, that vacation really was amazing. So if you ever get a chance to go to Norway, I hope you will. It is absolutely beautiful. I am back for another card challenge. <clears throat> Excuse me. And to announce two weeks ago our card challenge, because, uh, you know, obviously I wasn't here last week to do a challenge. But hey, Luana, how are you? Oh, goodness. Um, we have some big announcements today. So tomorrow is June 1st, and we have two things going on. The first thing is we're going to have a designer series paper sale. Woo! 15% off all designer series, well, select designer series paper in the new catalog. So those of you who did the paper share with me, um, you have an idea of which papers that you really are falling in love with, and now you can get them on sale and there's no limit. So that's exciting. Also, starting tomorrow, we have a joining special. If you have never joined Stampin' Up! before or um, you have in the past and then you've let your... Um, You've, you've dropped and, and you're back as a regular customer now, I want you to consider joining again. Um, when you are a member of Stampin' Up!, when you are a member of Reese's Paper Pieces, um, the, you get so many benefits. One being you get a 20% discount on all of your shopping. That's the biggest benefit. But then you also get um, the benefit of being with this amazing group of community of stampers, my team, plus all the other uh, Stampin' Up! demonstrators. And believe me, I was just on a cruise ship with some of the top demonstrators and it is an amazing group of people. You really want to be a part of Stampin' Up! It's just being, being a demonstrator is where it's at. Anyway, so that is what's going on. We have two things starting tomorrow. We have the designer series paper sale starting tomorrow, and we have a joining special. Um, for $99, you get $155 worth of product, plus free shipping, plus a paper pumpkin, plus some business stuff, plus you just get to be a part of my awesome team. Okay, so we are Creative Card Challenge Wednesday. We've got a lot of people in the house this morning. We've got Tony and Michelle, Renee, Marsha, Janet, Kay, Elaine, Giselle. We have Noreen, Michelle again, Tiffany, Linda. Good morning, all y'all. Thank y'all so much for showing up so bright and early with me. I do still have a little bit of a cold, as you can hear. Yeah, congestion in the lungs and in the head. It's just so fun <laughs> coming home from a vacation sick. Uh, oh, well, I'll survive. All right. So last or two weeks ago, we had a card challenge and it was the card challenge. Um, what was it? I totally forgot. Um, did I not write it down? I did not. I wrote down the challenge winner. <laughs> Hold on. Let me grab that uh, share screen. Okay. Window. Here it is. And our winner is Diane Train. And Diane Train is a winner of tags. That's what it was. Tag it. So you had to have a tag on your card. And you can see her cute little tags here. One says love and one says dream. So Diane, congratulations. I already have your mailing address since you have shopped with me. And I have already put it in the mail for you. So be expecting a little uh, prize for me for having your name drawn. Congratulations again. All right, this week we have, let me um, switch that off. This week we are going to do, there we are, things with wings, okay? So uh, whatever you can think of with wings. I'm going to do a bird, but it could be a bug, you know, like a, butter, uh, a butterfly or a ladybug. It could be an airplane. Uh, it could be a bird, but whatever has wings, things with wings. That's our challenge this week. And I'm pulling out the stamp set, Seasonal Branches. If you missed this bundle, this is an amazing bundle because it is so versatile. This is one of our most versatile sets. It has spring. Uh, oh, no, I'm sorry. Spring. Here's the dogwood. Spring, summer. So you could do bright green leaves for summer then winter berries, and then fall. You could do fall leaves. Um, you could also do winter with no leaves at all. Um, then you have love and thanks and happy birthday and get well and 
Um, may you feel sheltered in the love that surrounds you, sending you abundance of, sending you an abundance of love, an abundance of thanks, an abundance of get well wishes. So a great stamp set. And I've got a little bird here for my wings. So we're going to be using this. And it's got all these great cutouts. Um, we're going to use the dogwood flowers here and the branches. We're going to cut out our little bird. So we've got all that. All right, let me check my comments, make sure. Uh, remember, if you need my attention or if you have a question, put like a question mark or an exclamation mark in front so I can see it. Most of it is good mornings and hellos and shares. Oh, thank you all so much for sharing. It helps so much um, to get the word out because we want as many people to participate as possible because it's so much more fun when we have more people. All right. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to pull out a... Uh, crumb cake. I'm pulling out my crumb cake and it's just five and a half by eight and a half. Just that uh, traditional size. And I'll get my bone folder so I can get a nice crisp edge there. Now, have you all seen this paper? Holy gamoli. You know, when I was doing y'all's paper share, I had no idea I had, um, we had a 48 sheet pack. Wow. This is called the Delightfully Eclectic Paper Pack. And um, it just has all kinds of different designs. I mean, pretzels, which goes great with our brew to you uh, stamp set, the beer stamp set that we have. Um, we have daisies and swans and flowers and graphics. Just really a great um, and eclectic collection of different papers. And look at all the color that's in this pack. And this is a 45 sheet pack. This is like having, um, is it 45 or is it? Oh, hold on. I don't want to lead you astray. Let me pull it out. Um, uh, do, 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 sorry about that. I meant to look this up before I started. Here it is. Yeah. Four each of 12. So yeah, it's 48 sheets. Um, so that's like getting four packs of paper because our paper packs are usually 12 sheets. So this is 48 sheets of uh, 12 by 12 paper. Wow. And it's $30. It's not the $12.50, but it's still a great bargain. So that is the paper I've pulled out. It's amazing. So it's a great pack. I am not sure if it's on sale. We'll have to check tomorrow to see if it's on sale. I don't have the actual papers that are on sale until tomorrow. The sale starts tomorrow. It's just select papers that are on sale. So you'll have to check back tomorrow. It'd be great if it's on sale. Um, but even if it's not, it's a great value. Okay, so I'm taking this piece. It's the this one here. And I'm just putting that on the top. And the reason I chose this is because um, even though those are five petal uh, flowers, they're very similar to the, the shape of the dogwood, which the dogwood is only four petals. But anyways, no biggie. The other thing I'm going to do, I'm pulling out the old olive. And I just cut this at one and three quarters by two and three quarters. All right. And then this is from our new uh, countryside in the country. Oh, I'm sorry. Countryside corners uh, piece. So that's where this piece came from. All right. So I have that. So let me go ahead and adhere all this down. Like I said, this week's card challenge is things with wings. All right. So things with wings. All right. You can tell this is a scrap piece of paper here. <laughs> Right. And, and I kind of centered it uh, top and bottom here, but um, I did not, I left more room on this side. I don't know. I just, I kind of wanted it to skew a little bit. All right. And then this piece. Whoa. And if you all did not see my pictures from Norway, they are on my Instagram. So, um, and on my private Facebook um, uh, portfolio. My, um, whoops, we're having trouble here. I think I might've broke my, uh oh. Okay. There we go. Phew. Thought I broke it. Nope. Um, anyway, so my personal portfolio, my personal Facebook page, um, that's just Christina Cleveland Reese. Um, my pictures are on there, but they're also on my Instagram. And I just had a great time in Norway. Um, I got to hike up to um, a glacier 
it's they call them gla glaciers glacier i can't i i don't speak norwegian but anyways or with a british accent but anyways um glacier <laughs> um i call it a glacier they call it a glacier that's it it's a glacier anyways um it was really cool hiking up to that. And then we also hiked up to a waterfall. That was really beautiful. Um, so this is the branch from the set. And I just put some adhesive sheeting on the back before I cut the branch out. And then I'm going to get my tweezers here. Well, I think I'm going to get my tweezers here. There we go. And pull this off. There we go. <laughs> Brenda has a question. What does it cost to get the paper share? Uh, the paper share is finished, Brenda. Um, that was, I offer my paper share uh, just for that first, um, just for those first 10 days uh, right before the catalog came live, but it's no longer available. Um, so yeah, um, if you want the next paper share will be with the next catalog. So be sure that you are signed up uh, with my newsletter so you don't miss my next paper share. Good question. All right. So um, I'm going to have this branch kind of come off a little bit. And Well, no, wait a minute. No, I don't because I don't want the branch just hanging. I'm going to have the branch come off a little bit on this side. There we go. Yeah, there we go like that. And then we need our dogwoods and our bird. Now, this I have colored like the Western Bluebird. Michelle, my birder, um, by the way, Michelle, uh, the only bird I saw that was different in the United States were called, I want to say Iker ducks, but they are where the Iker down, that very famous down feathers uh, come from. The ducks there in Norway um, up in Scandinavia. So I saw a bunch of those. They were really cool. So Michelle, shout out to my birder. <laughs> here is the uh, Western bluebird here. And we're just going to put our little guy, little guy right there. We're going to put him up on dimensionals. Uh -huh. There we go. And then I just need some glue on these little dogwoods. And I love how um, these are embossed. So when you cut them out, they have the, um, the embossing of the petals of the dog flower, dogwood flower. I'll show you that in just a minute as soon as I get it glued on here. All right, so I'm going to put this one here. Oh, Tony says, yes, it is on sale for $25. Yay, Tony. Thank you for looking that up for me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, that is awesome. It's great paper. I mean, it's, yeah. So eclectic, uh, what did I call it again? Let me pull it out again. It's called Delightfully Eclectic. And I mean, look at that. You get 48 sheets. Yeah, it's like getting four packs. That's amazing. Okay, so now we have this, and I'm going to zoom in so you can see the detail of this dogwood. Is that really beautiful or what? So pretty. There we go. All right, so our challenge is you have to make a, oh, come on. There we go. You have to make a card that's got something with wings. It does not have to be birds. It can be, uh, it could be an airplane. It can be a uh, ladybug, bugs, anything with wings. So that is our challenge this week. I cannot wait to see what you guys create. I know they are going to be beautiful. Um, okay. And then remember, tomorrow starts our paper sale and the joining special. I'm going to come back live on Friday for Fun Fold Friday. I've also got to send out a newsletter. And if you want to see, oh, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to stamp it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, well, I will figure out something here. Hold on. Okay. Hmm, I was going to put thanks right there. 
Where can I put things? All right, help me out, you guys. What are we going to do here? Um, all right, let me get some scrap paper. That's what I get for talking and trying to craft at the same time. <laughs> Here's my thanks. And... All right. Hmm. All righty. Um. Put it over a flower. Yeah, that looks good. I like that. Okay, well, that was easy enough. Yay. And I sure hope my voice is back by Friday. I'm telling you what, it is no fun being sick. <laughs> um, Maria says, what's up with the blurry video, with the video blurry? Um, it's not blurry to me, Maria. I'm not sure what you're seeing blurry. Um, yeah, anybody else having a problem with the blurry? All right, Jeannie says, okay, how does this work? I make a card, wings, and upload it to mail it to you. Oh, no, 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 you don't mail them to me. See at the bottom of the page here, facebook.com forward creatingwithchristina.com. There's a post, and you take a picture of your card, and you put the picture in that post as a comment. That's how you participate, okay? You join the card ch challenge facebook.com forward slash creating with Christina and you put a picture of it in the comments. Okay. That was a good question. What else do we have? Okay. Um, Renee says eiders are found in Alaska and Northeast States like Maine. Ah, very good. Well, that makes sense, Renee, because that would be the same. Is that latitude, longitude, latitude, same latitude as Norway. That's right. Yep. Eider ducks. Very good, Renee. Thank you very much. Yep. But it was fun seeing those. I don't see them down here in Texas. <laughs> good, good, good. Okay. What else do we have? Oh, here's another question from Brenda. Oh, uh, no, I've already answered that question. Okay. All right. I'm not seeing any other questions. Let me zoom back down real quick. Okay. Kay says it's not blurry on her end and, and Ruby says it's not blurry on her end. Okay, great. Um, all right. Okay. So let me finish putting this um, thanks on here. There we go. All right. So um, once again, you are going to just take a picture of your card that has wings on it and uh right here at facebook.com creating with Christina, you'll see the post. It says um, creating card challenge and you just post uh, in the comments of that post. You just post a picture of your card and that's all you have to do. Then I have a random comment picker that I use. It's an app on my phone and I, and it randomly picks one of the comments, one of the cards, one of the pictures of the cards. And once again, congratulations um, to Diane Train. You won last week's or two weeks ago for the tag it. So I've sent your prize out to you. Okay. Awesome. Do I have anything else I need to share with you guys? I don't think so. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day and I will see you back for Fun Fold Friday and uh, can't wait to see what cards you guys make with wings. Okay. I love y'all so much. Thank you again. Bye-bye. <laughs>